All right, welcome back again on our Monday. Hope you've had a great day. The weather has certainly cooperated. Great conditions out there. Here's what we've got. First alert weather headlines. We'll see a lot of sunshine this week. Uh, some days a little cooler, some days a little warmer, but it is going to be uh, sunny regardless almost every day. Well above average temperatures ongoing. So even those days that it is going to be a little bit cooler, still going to be above normal. Now there is a possibility of rain and snow uh, right up toward the end of February, which would mean we're talking next week. Still keeping an eye on that. Uh, the potential is there for a little rain and snow, but again, that still looks like about eight, maybe even nine days away. Take a look again outdoors. We are looking very nice out there. Current conditions in Fargo 46 feels like 40 with that east south east wind at 13 miles per hour. More head we're at 45. Current conditions Grand Forks 38 degrees feels like 33 out there when you factor in that southeast wind at seven miles per hour. You can find your region here. We've got 39 Bemidji, 38 Thief River Falls and Grand Forks, 39 degrees Devils Lake, 41 for Jamestown, 45 in Fergus Falls. There are some showers two hours south. Those are moving off to the east northeast, not going to have an impact on our area. In fact, we're going to continue to see mostly clear skies as we head into the evening and overnight hours. Taking a look around the country, got a couple of showers. Intermountain West, Idaho getting some snow, of course, the California coast as well, and some rain off the coast of Florida and South Carolina. Otherwise, it's just kind of quiet all around. Lots of sunshine around the country today. First alert forecast moving into the overnight hours. Again, we continue to see that clear sky temperatures dropping down into the low to mid 20s. Could see just a little bit of fog develop around the Red River Valley tomorrow morning. Eventually, I think we'll see some high level clouds move through tomorrow afternoon. Still going to call it partly cloudy. Temperatures warming generally into the mid 30s to low 40s. I have about 41 in Fargo. Again, you see our overnight lows tonight. Got a couple teens out there. Devil's Lake and Langdon. Otherwise, we're looking at 20s tomorrow afternoon highs. Uh, low 30s to low 40s. 41 in Fargo, Sisseton. Those are the warm spots. Temperature trend. As we look ahead, we continue to see above average temperatures. In some cases, well above average. In some cases, just slightly above average. Either way, it is going to continue to be warmer than we'd expect to see for this time of year. 11 day planner. So today we're at 46 in Fargo. Tomorrow, a little bit of a drop. Still nice 41. Then on Wednesday, Going to warm it up to 50 degrees. Thursday, 46, a little breezy. Friday is the one day that stands out here. A little bit cooler this week, 32, which again, still above normal. Check out this next coming week in Courtney. 52 and 50, <laughs> mostly sunny, a little breezy on Saturday, 55 next Monday. It's all great. This does not look like your end of February weather uh, planner. No, it's like it's almost like you just really feel fooled into being in spring, and because it's been so nice right. for such a long time, it just, it really does feel that way. I hope it. I hope that's the case. Yeah. Thanks, Russ. Yeah.